Okay, Sorcerer Skies, I'm at the booth at ARP with Chris Braschke here, and Chris has just more recently been on board with the Team Sorcerers. We've bought a lot of fasteners through ARP before, but maybe not all of them, thinking that everything was created equal. So, as you recall, about a year ago, when we were in Las Vegas racing, we found some other parts in there that were not identifiable, and so, when we're trying to re-examine all the things that were going uh, haywire with us, we were micro-analyzing everything right on down to the bolts, our head studs and all that, and realizing like, oh, we got to clean up our program. We reached right out to the best ARP. Chris has loved to be on board, loved to help you out here. Fast forward a year later now, they actually have custom made some of the product for the Sorceress according to what we need in our application, which is very high demanding when you're building three or 4,000 horsepower and you're gonna drive it up and down the street for extended periods of time. It's just not found in the catalog that you can go to XYZ. And not only that, I've kind of built a little friendship and Chris has been coaching me all along about some of the things to look for as we go and pick the right kind of fastener, which what we're really talking about today is head studs. Through all that, I'm really excited because this is the day we've been waiting for. Chris is actually showing me pictures of the product that's almost done now, and it's being treated. What kind of treatment is that? It's just the black oxide uh, coating, basically. Do all head studs get that then? Uh, it just depends on what the material is, uh, you know, what, what you do to the material, what kind of uh, finish you put to it. Some okay. have a polish, some finish, some have a black oxide. I see. So in a sorceress, we have different lengths and we also have different thicknesses. How big is our biggest head stud? Uh, your biggest stud is 9 16 on that one, and then you have several uh, different lengths of uh, separate. Half, half inch, inch. half yes. inch. So 9 16 when you look at it, and it's a long stud, it's relatively long anyway, uh, you know, different applications. So looking at that, you got to get it right. And maybe we didn't have the right tools last time because what we had found was not only just in these head studs, but in our our fasteners in the, on top of the head with the, the hold down uh, clamping force of our stands, our rocker arms and all that, uh, I think we reached in a bolt bend that we probably shouldn't have been to and didn't get the right kind of fastener. So we're really excited with the Jessel folks and ARP folks having complete across the board engineered products to make the sorcerers happen, you know, do what it's supposed to do and, and make things happen the way we're expected it to. We're, uh, when we were running before, it was a consistent problem, and a lot of it led to the prob problems of the fastener not being the correct one. So, with that said, I really appreciate them guys jumping on board with this, and we're really thankful. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate, appreciate it. it.